I want stronger materials. Efficient deliveries. AI. More effective medicines. Better health care. Cleaner transportation. Durable batteries. What a great wish list. And with the right tools, it can become a reality. That's why we're building a quantum computer. Welcome to VTT. My name is Deborah Berevicius, and I am a lead scientist in quantum computing at VTT, one of Europe's leading research institutions. Welcome to our video series, The Quantum Advantage. At its core, a regular computer stores information in what we call bits, which are series of ones and zeros. On the other hand, a quantum computer stores information in quantum bits. We call them qubits for short. A qubit can be represented by a one or a zero, just like a classical bit, and it can also be represented by a combination of state zero and state one. Very much like if you have a spinning coin. You have two sides, heads and tails, but while it's spinning, you get a combination of both heads and tails. The qubit is what makes a quantum computer unique. In classical computer, we continuously switch between zeros and ones uh, in its bits to perform classical computations. But qubit is much more. We can perform more complex operations on it. These operations follow the rules of quantum mechanics. And leveraging this, we can design new kinds of algorithms that solve some types of problems much faster than the classical computers. Because a quantum computer uses qubits rather than regular bits, it can actually speed up some calculations. In some cases, the speed up would be modest, but in other specific cases, the speed up would be mind boggling. Calculations that would take a classical computer billions of years could be calculated with a quantum computer in the blink of an eye. Quantum computing is not just about speed. It's a fundamentally new way of harnessing nature to do computation. And that is why quantum computers can help us tackle the really challenging problems on our wish list. Imagine you are a parcel delivery company looking for the fastest and cheapest way to deliver parcels to your customers. With a classical computer, there are so many configurations that to explore all of them, it will take too long, and we often settle for a good solution, which is not necessarily the optimal one. With a quantum computer, instead, we can design quantum algorithms which can exploit the superposition between zero and ones and find the optimal solution in a reasonable amount of time. Because of their speed and complexity in the way they calculate things, quantum computers are going to help solve important and complex problems in the future. This is going to impact existing businesses and create new ones. In future episodes, we will be looking at specific industries and how quantum computing can create exciting new opportunities for companies and their customers. Thank you for watching the first episode of our series, Quantum Advantage. Please don't forget to click below to follow us. And I look forward to seeing you next time.